Nine. What are all these numbers? Well, if you're not from Mumbai or haven't ever stayed here, you would not know what these numbers are. They are in fact the numbers of the double-decker buses that plied on Indian roads. And just when you thought that it was the end of the road for them, well, there's this one. And it's all about keeping the environment clean. Yes, the double decker has gone electric and it's massive to look at. Over 14 feet tall, it's as tall as a giraffe. And at 32 feet long, it's almost the same size as a killer whale. And its wheelbase is as much as the length of a car. And what's more, it's developed, designed and manufactured right here in India, in Chennai in fact. Switch Mobility was created by the coming together of Ashok Leyland and Optare of UK. Both companies with tremendous experience in building buses. Sitting on the 9-meter EV bus chassis, the Switch EI V22 double-decker gets a steel and aluminium frame along with anti-roll bars for better stability. At the front, the Vevelop suspension setup brings in stability and better control for the driver. Given that, he will have to tackle the bad roads and traffic. And at the rear, there's air suspension, which again can help provide a stable ride and doesn't disturb the passengers inside. Well, the seats are extremely comfortable and Though they are lightweight, they are of high quality. In fact, they are lightweight because the overall weight of the bus has to come down. That's the main reason for it. But space is a bit restrictive, especially for a big person like me. The passenger beside me is going to be very uncomfortable. And given that concern, I shifted seats to sit in the place where I wouldn't be a menace to anyone inside. Or would I? And boy, oh boy, is this a dream come true? Driving a double-decker bus. As a kid, I've always imagined how it would be. And well, it's very overwhelming. Considering that you don't know how far up this goes, uh, it's very scary. Very scary. But I got a hang of things after a few rounds. The motor control unit, battery management system and hardware for the twin chargers are all under the rear deck and the permanent magnet motor is near the axle. So the balance is perfect and the center of gravity lower to bring it better stability. This one gets a 231 kilowatt hour battery pack. Uh, well, it has 315 bhp on offer, but that's inconsequential because the pulling power this one needs has to be more. So there's 3,100 newton meters it has to offer. And you know what? This does pull very easily, given how big it is, given how large it is. All of that said, the steering wheel is a little smaller than what we we are used to seeing on uh, double-decker buses but it's all right it's less fatigue even for the drivers and overall visibility on all fronts 
is really, really lovely. Yes, I am down nostalgia lane because the double decker is very much part of the Mumbai skyline, and thanks to switch mobility, it will continue to be. This seat right here is going to be the most sought after because of the view it has to offer. And as a kid, I got a different view of what was happening outside on the road because of this very seat, and I had to run to get my hands on it. Uh, and then talk about the miniature cars, the taxis, rickshaws and even the bald men. Uh, I used to count them all and then go and tell my grandma about it. It is all part of my story and thanks to this, it is still going to be. Close to 200 of these 65-seater electric buses will soon hit the road. So get ready for a cleaner, greener, an emissions-free ride.